Hello everybody, Sinus111 here, and welcome back to more FTL Faster Than Light. I'm doing marginally better than what I did earlier. I was able to repair from just one point of hull integrity, but unfortunately we've been running out of fuel way too many times. So you know what this means, more waiting for help. A poorly armed slug ship cruises by and offers us this. Oh, burps. Let me start over. A poorly armed slug ship cruises by and offers assistance. Their captain seems to be chuckling to himself, perhaps at the prices he's charging. A15 scrap for five fuel. I have over a hundred scrap. I'll do it. You doubt he is trustworthy, but have no choice but to make the deal. However, you complete the exchange without event. What the hell? Everything looks secure, but suddenly a number of supplies disappear. He must have pain planted a portable teleporter into your cargo bay somehow. Before you can react, his ship is long gone! Well, isn't that just great? Isn't that just great? I knew there was something suspicious about this ship and its captain. I'll have to visit these two beacons then head for the store for even more fuel. As soon as you jump into the system, you receive a hail from a nearby civilian NG vessel. Their captain appears on your screen. Strange bug. Can you assist in debugging? This to the problem. Found malfunctioning mantis. Believes it is human. Will receive input only from human. Danger evaluation. Extremely high. Provide assistance. Well, I have a mantis crew member with me. So, I believe option 4 would be the least dangerous. The Mantis is terrified at the sight of your crew member. He immediately attacks his NG rescuers and your crew member is forced to kill him. The NG are grateful for your help and offer a small reward. And I got more fuel out of it. Going to the store to get some more after this. You are immediately contacted by a settlement. Hello, travelers. Your ship seems to be outfitted for combat. Care to take up a bit of mercenary work? <clears throat> yes. Some of our friends have taken to piracy in the recent chaos of the war. We'd like you to convince them of the poor decision by severely damaging their ship. We'll pay you well as long as you don't kill them all. I, I accept. <clears throat> Just be sure not to blow them up. They say nervously as they direct you to a nearby moon. You find the pirate ship stopped there. They immediately respond to your parents with, Your money or your life. They must be new to this. Well, what dialogue? They may indeed be new to this. Who knows? I may know. Watch it. There you go. Got his weapons. They hail your ship saying, You win. We're not cut out for this. Well, I'm a man of my word. I'll let them live and return to their settlement. Sh settlement. With the pirates dissuaded from their career path, you return to the settlement. Thank you. They returned to us before you did. I don't think we'll need this anymore. 41 scrap, heavy laser mark two. Great. Now, it's shop time. Let's head to the store beacon. The NG can do remarkable things with just a pile of scrap. The NG hive at this beacon are selling 
equipment for just that. I thought hive was an action verb for a second. Or just a verb in general. Um, I think I want more fuel. Repair all. Some more drone parts. Good, good. Keep it coming. I think I could do with... shield charge booster for right now. What other mints do I have? Just this one. Really. I'd better get my door subsystem repaired before we move on. Can't forget about that. Distress beacon's all about now. You follow the distress beacon to a tiny asteroid belt. You find a small ship struggling to maneuver through the field. Do you require any assistance? They respond. Help! Our shields are down and we won't last long. Oh no you don't, asteroid. Trying to take their lives. You try your best, but one stray rock hits a key structure in their ship. It breaks apart in front of your eyes. You salvage what you can before leaving and try not to think about the lost crew. Well, good thing we tried. An advanced rebel automated ship remains stationed near a small rebel space station. Sensors indicate it's a storage vessel for military goods. Attack! Oh. Drone repair system. Not good. Gotta have that fixed. You're joking me. I just... I just activated this drone and you destroyed it? Immediately? What kind of crap is that? Oh. I can't believe this happened. <sighs> well, at least you're dead. You salvage what you can from the broken ship. The station is a storage site for military-grade weapons. You find one that can be easily attached to the ship. 22 scrap and a heavy laser mark 1. Now we have two variants of heavy lasers. Now what to do with them? What to do, I wonder? Well, this for one. I wonder how my enemies will fare with this. You're greeted by a rare sight. A mantis ship that appears not to have noticed you. Attack to remain. Uh, not attack. I'll attempt to remain concealed. If he turns to fight me, then so be it. You power down non-essential systems and wait for the OTL drive to charge. They either don't want to fight or have failed to notice your ship. The latter being more likely. Well, missed opportunity here. Let's visit a few more beacons before we move on to the next sector. The only other ship at this beacon messages you. Finally, after months of waiting, someone has fallen into our trap. Pirate ambush! Quickly. Take them out.
Ouch. I need the fuel. I don't have any missile weapons. No. Oh, that's much worse. I should have accepted the offer. I should have accepted that offer. If I knew I wasn't going to get any fuel from that fight. A cluster of NG satellites in orbit of a nearby planet are the only clue to the mechanical species was ever here. You have other places to be. Oh, you bet I do. I better upgrade my weapons system soon if I want to have all four of my weapons online. Oh, oh, for scout of the rebel fleet. Gotta deal with him quickly. As fast as I can, too, because they're powering up their FTL. If they get away, they'll warn the fleet. Going down. A hole at 75%. Because I don't give a crap. Their ship breaks apart, and you are relieved to know that you are still one step ahead of the fleet. Yay. Ooh, look at that beacon. I'm not gonna risk it. You've arrived at the long range beacon. When the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. You come across a pirate in hot pursuit of an unidentified ship. You quickly receive a transmission from the pirate. Stay out of this fight, it will make it worth your while. Pursuit! I'm gonna be a hero and attack him. The pirate ship stops its pursuit and locks weapons onto your ship. I think the... I think his victim is going to take this as a cue to escape. But we'll see. I don't know if I've had any good things come out of this. But we'll see. Oh great, my drum system's damaged again. Fine. Our previous offer was not generous enough. Let's improve it. I still not gonna I'm still not gonna get any fuel of this, so I'm gonna continue my assault. Thank you very much. A few more hits and you'll be down. Well, one more hit and you'll be down. You're dead. The pirate explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. You go to the ship you just saved. Thank the heavens you showed up! We don't have much to offer as a reward, but our engineer should be proficient enough to patch your ship up a bit after that nasty fight. Uh, thank you, engineer. Oh, there's a storm. I'm not gonna risk going there and fighting the fleet again. Or the first time in this playthrough, really. We have a Slug Home Nebula or a Rebel Stronghold. I'm being extra careful here. I want to go to the Slug Home Nebula. I don't run a risk getting... getting crippled, just like I have been getting crippled in that first sector. 
The slugs developed on an ocean planet where the ability to telepathically sense another organism was more important than sight. Today they use this ability to navigate unfettered the depths of the nebulas they inhabit. Good information. Very good information indeed. But I think this is where I'm going to end stuff off before I continue. Um, I have ship upgrades that I want to make in the next part, but um, I'll just wait a bit. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!